Hello everybody and welcome back to a rendered edition of d and &E Doodles. That's right. Uh, it's fight time. Whoa. Fight! <laughs> Test uh, your might. This is one I wrote down a while back, but uh, it's we're pitting our doodles against each other this week. Oh. So, I feel like that's about as much explanation as you really need for this prompt. <laughs> Yeah, we fighting. And uh, D will be the first to start. Oh, yay. <laughs> so I <laughs> You chose a wanted very to do... interesting jo do fight. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I thought of doing a fight title, like a screen before you fight someone. Because mm -hmm. I thought that'd be cool. And I was like, looking through all our characters... And I was like, dang, most of these are, like, just fan art, basically. <laughs> so I was trying to find something that's, like, at least that I do. You do a lot more, I feel like. I don't know. I guess we kind of do fan arty episodes a lot. And I was like, what did we draw that's, like, original? And then I saw your beautiful Deku clown. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> and I was like, oh, man, that guy is definitely going in. <laughs> so I drew him. I just, it's funny what ones you like keep, because like I, after making the Deku Cloud, I basically never thought about him again. <laughs> well, I was looking through all of our videos yeah. to get ideas, so I was like, oh, I remember this guy. He's cool. Struggling with the arm, I see. Yeah, so I did all these, uh, I kind of use this as like a, I use these kind of sometimes as like studies or practices. So I was doing a lot of like hand stuff, and I actually did that hand with not looking at anything which is not even you should but <laughs> you should not i was like let me sure. yeah i was like let me see what i can do here Ooh, and i thought it was pretty chin. cool yeah <laughs> i feel like he would be like a bob type of fighter nice uh little tekken <laughs> yeah that's who you reminded me of just like a kind of you know a little chubby guy but also is swift <laughs> No, I was just like, this is perfect. I don't get him looking fierce, you know? It's funny because yours is so, like, just simple and I had to kind of make him, like, an actual <laughs> defined character. Yeah, so... And who's his opponent? <laughs> yeah, this is from the Dragon Ball, right? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I was like, we have to have another clown that I can do. And then I saw him singing gracefully in the clouds on our thumbnails and I was like, yes. <laughs> <laughs> All the uh, double clowns, baby. Anime fight right here, actually. This is a very anime fight. I don't know where those two lines came from. <laughs> I erased one of them. He doesn't wear a shirt, so I got to do some anatomy here. Which I also liked how that came out. Got that, like, smug smile on him. I'm thinking uh, the Deku clown wins this fight. He looks more serious. I don't know. Your guy has literal powers of like clouds and stuff, and the Deku clown yeah. is in fact just a clown. <laughs> <laughs> he just throws his unicycle at you. Here, I'm just doing the line art. Got a nice, my usual custom line art brush that I use. Mm -hmm. It's made of tiny eggs. Yeah, it's actually small individual eggs that uh, come together to form a line. Just got the getting the inks down here. I actually really liked uh, the Deku clown guy's pose I came with here. Mm -hmm. He's it was a fun like, he's like fighting I'm gonna, vibe. I'm gonna pick your nose. He's like, come here so I can pick it. <laughs> <laughs> You ever heard of don't pick your friend's nose? Well, you're my enemy. Yeah, and then he honks it, and it's like... Eh, 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 eh. And I tried to stay true to the colors we used. Yeah, I probably made him true. a little darker, because, you know, you know how we do. We do that a lot. <laughs> that Deku, I left him full white body paint. Yeah, it's iconic to the Deku. I had to get my verses in there. This is where I was figuring out what I, color I want to do. For my shading mm -hmm. did a little uh clipping quick clipping group art tip there so you can yeah. i just found this out after 
<laughs> doing this by hand for so long. <laughs> you guys probably already know to use this, and you're like, Are you, do you even do art? And I'm like, sometimes. D loves, you know? D loves when he uh, makes it more complicated than it has to be. Yeah. <laughs> That's his I was trying to, thing. yeah, I was trying to figure out like where I want the light coming from here, mm. and there's not really a light source because it's like a battle screen, but I just kind of wanted some pop. So this is me fidgeting around, like how would light in this way come if it was like behind you but kind of over your shoulder? Mm -hmm. So I was just you know blocking out some shades, seeing what I liked, what looked weird to me. I, like, I thought you were just going to keep it like that for a second. I was like, what? Yeah. <laughs> and I was like, ooh, I kind of like that. Okay. I, He's so the this is, I'm gonna. This is a tip I don't do, uh, but like for figuring out light sources, uh, what you can do is doodle uh, the image from the perspective of the light source, and anything that it can't see would be shaded. Yeah, maybe like a quick thumbnail or something yeah. to get your uh, ideas out. That's always a good idea. Yeah, so anything the light source itself wouldn't see will be shaded. I haven't I haven't used that technique yet, uh, but it does. It was cool. It's a cool thing. I was like, huh, that makes sense. Yeah, it's a good way to approach it, honestly. I always like doing... I feel like I've been trying to put more, like shading like heavy shading where things are actually all darkness like the whole front of this character uh huh or at least shaded because i feel like i just do mostly like kind of highlights and just shading to make things pop more than actual light sources so i've been trying to practice that it's crazy how different your drawings can be just with a nice like a good light source yeah it gives it a lot of line does a lot yeah, a lot more, you know, life. And this is me struggling with his hair lighting. And I was like, how does this make sense? Where does and his then, hair end and where does his hat begin? That's what I also didn't know. So <laughs> I, <laughs> I don't it, know if it's his it hair. Is his it? Hair. I think it's his hair. Yeah. He just puts <laughs> I think bells it is. on the end of his hair. <laughs> yeah, he just like some little jingles. And I was like, well, this this kind of makes sense. I don't believe that <laughs> lighting like that. I want to do orange. I tried to match the the characters with like a either similar or kind of contrasting shade color. So I did an orange for this guy, mm -hmm. a very dark orange. This is where I fell asleep at the table. Yeah, for the next twenty minutes, it's just D looking at it like this. Yeah, just you know, take your breaks. I always got to do that. Just having a nice long stare off. I'm just really letting them get in the mood to fight. <laughs> oh, it moved. Back, back to the hair. <laughs> Still hate it. <laughs> I, it's like, God, I like, how does this work? I, I just love this weird nonsense of hair and hat. Where it just I know. <laughs> <laughs> I lowered the opacity to give it just a regular shade look. I was like, I forgot to shade the nose. There we go. I probably messaged you. Yeah. <laughs> and this guy went for like a dark blue. This is like a contrast color to the green. I thought it was pretty cool. I, st I actually get him. I love his double chin so much. Yeah, he has to. He was chubby. Yeah. Just like Had Deku, be that. you know? <laughs> yeah, just like our favorite hero, Deku. You made his thing like more of a scarf thing, so that's what I did. That's fair. I think that was the idea. It was just like something they bought. Yeah, he took his cosplay to a whole new level and entered the Tekken universe. <laughs> At fighting as a copyrighted cosplay. <laughs> we got actual. We want My Hero Academia to sponsor our fighting game. Actually, our clown fighting game. <laughs> yeah. You know, like how in, in, this the, guy. <laughs> in the Street yeah, Fighter well, one, we they made Ryu and Chun Li Street Fight or uh, Power Rangers. I mean, oh yeah, uh, yeah. We we did that, except it's all clowns. Yep, <laughs> it's clown <laughs> clown time. I made the light kind of 
the same for both of them. So on the other guy, it would be more towards his front. And then I wanted like a kind of explosive y, smoky, yeah, the like fiery weird, background. The like half kind of action, whatever that fighting games have, I get you. Yeah, I almost got inspired to do like a retro Street Fighter screen where they're just the, the little squares. <laughs> but then I was like, oh, nah, I want to do like a background at least. And I, I had already drawn this full pose of Deku, so I was like, well. <laughs> <laughs> too late pop out the verses with some red on the the background there and I think that's pretty much all I did maybe some minor like line fixes and stuff just looking at it marveling in your clowns yeah this was really fun I enjoyed it I love the clown off that happened apparently I know <laughs> I was like, these are going to be a curveball of characters right here. <laughs> Anyways. Uh, oh, yeah! Sorry, got to rain them on. <laughs> and a t actual tank oh, reference. I love that you got reference of a tank. <laughs> Use your references, people. Yeah, don't Do you think like I know me. what a tank looks like going over a hill? No. <laughs> now you do. This now is amazing already. <laughs> just that I actually pulled out a tank reference. <laughs> yeah, and you're using Arigato Mon, Arigato oh, Reina. Yeah, I tried to use some of the ones that didn't get much of a chance from our earlier <laughs> stuff, so. I hope he has the same look of disdain. Oh, don't worry. <laughs> oh, yes! <laughs> <laughs> oh, yes. Oh, he is a Roblox gun, baby. <laughs> That's just what it looks like, apparently. Nice. Oh, man. <laughs> but yeah, uh, I... <laughs> Ari got to write him on one of my favorite just unhinged things we've done. Because <laughs> 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 it just... It's just the most absurd design. <laughs> oh, man. And then I had to look up. I couldn't remember if it had two wings or not. Nope. <laughs> no, I, I think it technically did. Oh, it might have. Yeah, it might. I couldn't remember, though, so... It does now, baby. But who could they... Who could Arigatsu Rainamon possibly be fighting? What what opponent? Is that a Tamagotchi? <laughs> it's not there yet. It's oh, Malphite. Oh, no. <laughs> it's a recent callback. <laughs> it's Obama Snow. <laughs> the little one. But wait. Oh, oh there's more of them. <laughs> there's many of them. <laughs> He's just a sport hunter. He's a trophy hunter now. <laughs> I guess. <laughs> Aw, I like these ones. I love Mount Butt. I actually do think it's generally a really nice design. Don't shoot the little ones. Come on. <laughs> nope. No mercy from our... No mercy. <laughs> I like the composition here he went with. Yeah, I, I tried to something uh, a little different than most of what I usually do. Has a good sense of, like, movement. I Action. originally, I wanted it to look like that guy was, like, using the... Because the, my initial idea was, like, they can just create the nature or whatever. So I wanted it okay. to look like he was, like, sprouting the tree, the bush out of there. But it ended up not looking like it. But it also is kind of funny that Arigato Rainamon is just straight up shooting innocent creatures. Yeah. <laughs> just like the gun. <laughs> Like, what, <laughs> what for? Like, what did they do? I don't know. <laughs> probably nothing. They're probably just living, and Arigato Rainamon saw them and was like, eh, I might as well, I'm bored. Yeah. <laughs> just deforesting with the, <laughs> the tank treads. <laughs> that's not even, like, their, that's not even the plan. That just happened. Yeah. <laughs> he just rolled up in there and was, like, started blasting. 
Well, we both took the idea of a fight differently here, so I like yeah. that. Mine's arguably not much of a fight, I will say. <laughs> Yours is a genocide. <laughs> yeah, there's not much <laughs> fighting back from the from the Mount Butts. We're gonna get flagged for violence. <laughs> for gun. Mm -hmm. For square gun. <laughs> for gun that doesn't look anything like a gun. <laughs> it's a Digimon gun. Can be whatever. <laughs> the Digimon guns look much more like real guns than ours. <laughs> they do. They have like full on like automatic cannon blasters. Nice, took a nap. Yep. Had a look at something probably. I do kinda like that he's like almost trying to take cover behind that, it looks like. <laughs> yeah, he's terrified. <laughs> like clearing the bush, you know, he's trying to like jump over. <laughs> yeah. Again, like it's it's one of those funny happy little accidents. Where, like, it was supposed to be he was making the bush, but it's really funny <laughs> that it's yeah. just him trying in vain. I know, I like a lot of times when you do art, you'll have, like, your idea, but you'll draw it and it looks like a different thing, but then you like that. <laughs> yeah. And it, everyone's Actually, favorite part about when I draw. <laughs> yeah, let's go. Erase those colors, baby. Oh, so much terror. Especially those ones in the back. So much fear in their eyes. And yeah, especially Arigatomon. I can see the remorse. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. It's, it's, like, <laughs> I, it's like Jack in the Puss in Boots movie. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> He's like, oh, all right. Well, I'll kill him anyway. <laughs> At this point, it would be a shame to let him live. <laughs> They're already so scared. I had to look up what I called it there. <laughs> Mom, but. <laughs> and that's it. Yep, yeah. I'm done. I quit. <laughs> he said, all right, that's enough. Ooh. Selecting? Yep. Yeah, this looks like it would be a nightmare for me to do. Just because of all the where your lines actually end. Yeah, there's a lot of like half lines that ends up like that where it just kind of fades into mm -hmm. something. Where is oh, this? Man. There's one part this I just guy. could not find <laughs> what layer something was on. Nice. We love when that happens. I'm gonna get your color. I like how you added. Not just uh, one of them, but like a little pack. Yeah, they're like a little, they're just like little creatures, apparently. Just a little happy family, and here comes, you know, the arch nemesis. <laughs> <laughs> Again, I was like, and when I originally like wrote that prompt down, I was gonna like do an actual fight. Yeah. <laughs> but then it just became this for. <laughs> then you were like, how about this? These poor creatures. <laughs> yeah, and once again, who knows why Ari got to Rainamon's here? Yeah, why are they even <laughs> in this region? How have they infiltrated the Pokemon regions? <laughs> like, pull out your Pokedex. Which one is that? It's. I don't even know. It's telling me to pull out a Digi device. I don't. <laughs> It says incompatible? Yeah. <laughs> it says copyright infringement? I don't... <laughs> I don't what? understand. Who's copyright? Game Freak has now stopped my game from working. <laughs> this guy comes out when you're fighting the, the Elite Four. <laughs> Shoots you. <laughs> <laughs> no save, you have to restart the game. Yeah, I love how it's coming over the hill like that. It's cool. Yeah, I that was the biggest reason I wanted our got to rain them on is because I wanted to draw a cool tank. The tank, yeah. <laughs> you know, just the Digimon for the tank. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> well, like, I guess I like sometimes trying to go out of stuff I would usually draw. And like I was yeah. like, oh, our I, I mean, I like our got to rain them on. I think it's one of our fun. Like I said, it's one funny, of our funniest yeah. is unhinged designs. 
I, and, like, but, the dichotomy of, like, the simplicity of Mount Butt versus it, too, is really funny. Yeah, like a super complex design. And then just these little little guys. Oh, what happened to the rubies? Oh, they're just on a layer I turned off for a bit. Oh. It's why also you. all the... Ease and tools. All the Mount Butts are now one color. Yeah. <laughs> and they're back. And now it's back. Ooh, nice. Uh, another favorite part about having a yeah. oh. style. Gonna get all the snowy butts. I remember you asked me once, like, why I don't just do this in general, and this is why. <laughs> it's it's honestly more work. Yeah. That's a lot. A lot of process there. I feel like when I try to feel like that it doesn't work which i don't know why uh check your tool like specifics because they might just need to be lowered a bit and there we go <laughs> this is amazing <laughs> this is great. <laughs> oh man uh but that that well, that's our renders for today guys um let us know what you guys thought if you guys want more different yeah, ones what you got any renders you want us to make of previous episodes let us know um yeah. and uh go ahead and hit the bell it will notify you every tuesday and thursday when we drop new episodes and yes uh, sir. Like, the, yeah, like the video if you liked the video and thanks everyone for watching we will catch you guys on the next one goodbye